Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Let's go to Marathon Glide and it's going to be another similar event to that um Remember that one stage that I had to do with the coin challenge? Yeah, this is the exact spot actually. So I should be relatively used to this. <laughs> Okay, so since I only have to reach the goal in order to get the goal... Uh, what am I supposed to do there? <laughs> well, yeah, since I'm only supposed to reach the goal for the gold, I don't have to sidetrack or, you know, chain combo kill things and whatnot. I can completely skip that first Goomba, actually, if I wanted to. And I think I will. Oh, that... Because he's a green Koopa, he kind of falls off the edge and okay there we go I just needed a little bit more air room I mean a little bit more distance gliding okay it's my next target I'm just gonna stay high and improvise my landings at each enemy I hate when I have to go upwards though that's kind of an issue <laughs> I knew there was going to be a coupon here. Oh no! I should have just went for the one on the stairs. Okay, it's... I've got this, don't worry. Just a gentle flight lesson. <laughs> Somehow I managed to miss that third Goomba, but whatever. So, plop. Plop. Plop, and then up here, hit him, I notice their hitboxes are really big, so there's not really that much of a worry, yeah, I know I can skip all that, hit you, fly here, looking good, but so did the other run, <laughs> I never count the game out to kill you last second. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna wait for that Koopa to get a little lower this time. There we go. I'm getting close to the end. Oh god! No, 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 yes! <laughs> that segment was a little scary. Oh shoot. I need to see where I'm landing. Okay. Can't Risk the piranha plant. My god, this is a long course. <laughs> okay, I need to hit at least one of these just to be safe. Oh shoot, shouldn't have done that. Maybe I should have, I don't know. I'm gonna hit this one because I need all the forward momentum I can get. Oh wait, 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 need you. Come on. I think I've got this. I think I've got this because the end is right here. Yay! <laughs> that was a long one. That was pretty fun though. <sighs> that was only a two star one. Hmm. That seems kind of difficult for a two star one. Although, it was pretty easy to land on the enemy, so maybe not. Bubble up! Uh, how many... Can you actually use him to go up? Oh, I got... Yeah, I've got Tiny Mario. I was gonna say, you, you can't normally go up. Okay, so I gotta, I gotta keep the bubbles going here somewhere, some way, otherwise... But I don't know how, to, how, you want, how you want to spread them out or something like that. Oop. And I certainly have to... Oh, wait, wait a second. They're affected by my speed, so... Okay, this is going to take me a couple tries to get the hang of. <laughs> I just need to figure out the initial portion of it, basically. Then I should be able to use the walls and oh wait I, oh yeah you can't wall kick when you're holding something that's right hmm
Wow, it's just, I don't, I don't understand this one at all. Unless I'm just supposed to go, like, from right to left and left to right down the middle. And just, like, really, really gentle bubble streams or something like that. Or maybe I'm just supposed to use a single bubble stream to go forward and just, like, take advantage of the bubbles as they're going up. And then the Koopas are like more my obstacle than anything, maybe? Oh, oh, okay, maybe that's it. Okay, so, a couple bubble streams, couple bubble streams. And use the bubbles to fail. That's pretty high. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 maybe I got, I got the concept of this now. Okay, keep spraying bubbles everywhere. But don't move too erratically, otherwise the bubbles will be out of your reach. Okay, I'm gonna run out of time this this run, but I, I think I understand the concept of it now. Okay. I'm just gonna keep practicing here until time runs out, and I fail to keep bubbling, by the way. <laughs> yeah, okay. Another shot! That one's pretty interesting. I see why it's a special challenge and why it, like it's a it's a challenge that is unlike other ones in their genres. Okay, so keep those bubbles going. Oh yeah! The Koopas being there also helps a little bit because those bubbles when you spray the Koopas, they don't fly all over the place. Alright, so Koopa's definitely a helpful commodity. Non-stop flight! Another one of these, huh? <laughs> and we got Hucket Crabs right off the bat. Wow. <laughs> okay, so I, sh I should probably aim for the uh, top Hucket Crab. Just go all the way up there, like that. I don't have to worry too much. Oh, you are going to offset my timing, though. <laughs> go, Pika Gam, go! Get the crab. Ah, it's, if you rush through that, it's not too bad. I'm gonna hit you. And then you. Oh, those uh, spike balls they're throwing are actually pretty helpful. Oh god, oh no. <laughs> that crossfire there might be a tricky portion. Hopefully the stage isn't too long. Right, I'm gonna hit you. I'm gonna skip on ahead, actually. I'm just gonna... Oh, maybe that's not gonna work. I should always try to look to see what I can skip rather than um, hitting every enemy along the way. I think I got the habit of hitting every enemy I could from um, those one-up challenges, because I really had to scrape down the... Um... Oh, you can jump on the rocks, really? But yeah, you really had to scrape the um, possibilities No, to get uh, as many lives as you possibly could. Like over here, I don't have to worry about those two down there, or I don't have to worry about doing a floaty jump there. I can just avoid spike balls with ease. You know, these just kind of clear the way for me. See, that's what happens when you pay attention, you actually win or something. <laughs> like over- oh, over there, I was gonna say I could use a rock to get higher rather than using the crabs instead, like using the rocks as bullet bills or something like that. I think that would be a, uh, a better way to go about doing things at that portion. Here. Like, what, I, my, what my, initially, like my initial thought was, because I wasn't sure about the stability of the rocks, was to use... Oh, I nicked one! Was to use the crabs to get up and over. Please do not be a long stage. 
<laughs> this one's pretty scary. Oh, I kind of screwed up that beginning there, but whatever. I recovered fine. Just need to there we go. Now, now everything should be in fine timing as it was before. And I should have aimed for the middle crab. <laughs> I shook my fist, but you couldn't see it. Come on. Just gotta do all my moves one at a time. Do not sway from the initial plan, otherwise you will be screwed. <laughs> there we go. I'm gonna hit this one because I can tell I'm not gonna get enough height on that other one. Hit you. Uh oh, shoot, shoot. No, 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 no. Yes, there we go. That works. <laughs> Alright, watch the spike balls, watch the spike balls, oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, I guess it was a pretty short stage. They knew, oh, they knew that one was a tricky one. So they, I guess they made it short. Not too bad. Whee! And moving on. Be gentle to giants! Oh, without... Uh, hmm. So I just gotta avoid the enemies. Power up, please! Oh, no, okay. I don't mind... Ooh, actually... Hmm. <laughs> I gotta wait for them to come along, don't I? In order for me to make that jump proper. Wait, where'd that... Oh, I was gonna say, where'd the third one go? You're gonna touch the wall and turn around, aren't you? Yeah, you are. So I'm still gonna have to... No! Where'd that Koopa come from? <laughs> well... Hmm... Didn't mean to do that. I already damaged an enemy once. You know what? <laughs> I just want to get off to a good start, basically. It's like... Figure out the beginnings to do it as efficiently as possible, and then wing the end. <laughs> now, th these Goombas here, is it possible to, like, jump in between them? And I think you get what I'm saying here. Like, be able to jump in between them rather than wait as long as I'm waiting here. Hello. If I don't do it early enough, that Koopa's gonna come back and get in my way. Okay. So, we're past the beginning! Oh, wow. I know, I'm surprised too. <laughs> I, I'd really like to have some running to my jump, so I have some uh, distance to get over them. It's, ra it's rather hard to make a jump over an enemy without some of that forward momentum. Because you're really trying, I mean, you're really threading the needle then otherwise. Uh, you are always going to be underneath my jump, so I should probably wait for you to get down here. Alright, that's enough dancing. <laughs> and up here, I know is the, um, it's pretty much nothing in your way. Okay. Well, aside, you know, from that one enemy, but you get what I mean. Alright, doing well. I'm, oh, God. Oh, no, wait, I can make that jump. That's not a big deal. I don't have to go on the pipe whatsoever. This one, however, might be an issue. <laughs> Unless I can, like... Okay. That works. That's not gonna work. <laughs> I think I'm supposed to triple jump through that section in order to get through that. I really don't like this beginning though, it's so slow. <laughs> I also like a power-up, that would be something kind of helpful. But alas, power-ups don't exist. Actually, you know what would be a little bit easier is not spawning that third Goomba on this line and just like spacing them out, if that's even possible. Uh, little like Koopa. He didn't spawn. That, well, that's all I meant. Like he, like the Koopas and stuff, 
they they should be more spaced out and I got myself in another tight spot here okay you turn back around red shelled Koopas don't fall off edges only the green ones do in case you didn't know that in Mario lore it's basic Mario stuff and oh no no I should have waited now I'm gonna have to wait even longer unless I can do like uh, a wall kick off this block. Yeah, that's how it's done. <laughs> it's this one again. Why are you so slow? Why? You have the same body structure as your little guys. I would think your muscles would be able to let you move just as fast. <laughs> mm, possible one-up opportunity if those blocks are solid enough to, ho to hold the green Koopa's power. You know, as you kick it against the block over and over and over and over again while staying in midair. Mm. Okay, so this is the part that I think they want me to triple jump with. Although, it might not be possible. <laughs> Okay, here, I can wait for that Goomba to go off the edge before I just jump the gun because I was running forward. Goombas, they fall off edges. They, they're a natural born suicider. <laughs> uh, well, it's easy enough to hit the Koopa and make that jump to the other side. But of course, I'm not trying to hit enemies. <laughs> but in that case, I'm gonna just hit it and just go on. I have a, a bunch of extra hits there to use and I'm going to take advantage of them unless you know I'm really aiming for the gold or something like that but I know I'm close to the edge and I don't want to mess this up at this point so yeah <laughs> and there we go so it's just, it's just that one Koopa that I think you gotta double or triple jump over and that does it i think i'm gonna end off the part here i hope you enjoyed and i will see you in the next part dance toad dance dance with joy at your accomplishments